Hello and welcome to Memescape News, the best source of information on the current happenings of the Memescape. I'm your host, Evan, and we've had a pretty interesting week, and uh, this week most of the memes are connected to events. So uh, with that clarification out of the way, let's get started. Top news for this week would probably be YouTube Rewind 2018 coming out. I made an entire video about why I hated it, which should be in one of these corners right about now. Of course, memes spawned out of it, because, you know, that's always what happens when people hate things on the internet. And the one that I particularly am thinking of is the one with, uh, Will Smith looking through the binoculars. <laughs> oh, that's hot. That's hot. That's hot. That's hot. Um, YouTube user jsunny420 made a green screen of it pretty quickly after the video came out and it already has something like 17,000 views and everybody's using it so good on him. Next, a teaser for the Sonic movie that's expected to be released next year put the Sonic fandom into a frenzy because the character just looks plain hideous. Look at this. Ooh. So of course people made memes of it. Like this one, take a look. Uh, next, on a little more somber note, a uh, prominent YouTuber, memer, and satirist, Monkey Jones, has had both of his channels falsely taken down by YouTube. His situation is pretty dire right now because all the strikes that were happened on his channel were false, but there's no real way for him to appeal to it because of just how terrible YouTube systems are. So please, go send him support and see if there's anything you can do. I'll, I'm trying to figure that out myself. So the only real meme this week that wasn't connected to an event was what I like to call Start Using Blank Language. Basically, this image containing the phrase Start Using Gen Z Language was spread and changed and is really still picking up steam. I think this format has a lot of potential and I really don't think it's hit its prime yet. So uh, I think we're going to see a whole lot more of this in the future, but I could be wrong, so I'll let you guys know next time. Lastly, I want to apologize about not covering something last week. Sprite Cranberry, which was a meme that originally surfaced around this time last year, has had another resurgence about last week, probably because the same ads that the meme is based off of always run at the same time during the holiday season. I like these a lot, I think they're funny. That's it for this edition of Memescape News. Did I miss something or say something inaccurate? Let me know in the comments and I'll mention it next week. See you ladies and gents later. you guys know next one. Come on. My computer display turned off.